Hey you, it's Evie, or Fibro Mom. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, we, we do all sorts of different kind of videos. Pretty much everything related to chronic illness, or I throw in a family vlog here and there. Just keep you updated with the fam. So, if you're new, I'd love it if you subscribe and join our Spoony fam, because we talk about all sorts of different kind of topics. So there's tons of videos out there for you. I'm sure you find something helpful, I hope. All right, you guys, today's video, I want to talk to you about the weather. Now, I know many people with fibro are in a lot more pain with weather changes. Now, I'm not saying all, but it seems like most with fibro, it's the cold that hurts them really bad. Me, it's the hot and the cold, like that humidity and the rainy. Well, I know a lot of you are bothered with the rainy, too, a lot of cold. I know so many of you appreciate my videos, and that means the world to me, believe me. But this one, I'm more or less asking you. What is it that you do that helps with the weather changes? Because, you know, just like when we plan, we plan on getting out of the house for a change, or even just going to the doctor appointment, or, or anything like that. It's like we got a plan, because, you know, usually a doctor appointment is going to take up your whole day. And then you're beat, and the next day you can't really plan for so much. You know what I mean? You know, weather, obviously, we can't control that. So I want to know what you guys do. Of course, I, I'm thinking majority of you are just winging it like I am. But I thought, why not ask? Maybe there's a little something that you guys do. I know a lot of you say you like to soak in, like, hot baths, warm baths, hot showers, warm showers, whatever. Seriously, that, that hurts me so bad, but I miss my hot baths and my hot showers. I know I brought this up in another video, but when you're in a lot of pain, it causes your muscles to get tense. Oh, uh, Mary, if you're watching this, we talked about this with massages, but same thing is like I will force myself to take a hotter shower. Once in a blue moon, a hot, uh, a pretty hot bath, like once a year, if that. Just to force those muscles to get loosened up, just like massages. I, I know that causes pain. Like I always say, it's ironic. We deal with some kind of pain just to lessen another pain. But, but it's true though. Although it causes that short amount of pain in the long run, it loosens up those muscles and make it feel better. But I'm talking about the weather, you guys. Just the other day, you might have seen it on Snapchat. Just the other day, it was 70 degrees. It was actually, I was getting sweaty outside, picking up that dog poop. <laughs> I was getting hot. Okay. But hours later, it starts hailing. Wait, no, that wasn't the dog poop day. It was Grandma's memorial. It was beautiful out, you guys. I think it was her memorial. I don't know. But yeah, it was really sunny, really warm. It was awesome. And later on, it started hailing. And I might have a picture to share with you. And then after the next day, we got s seven inches of snow. I thought it was five, but the the news guy said seven. So, and it was really icy. So, um, but you know, with the weather bouncing back and forth, I know Wisconsin is a terrible state to be living in when it comes to weather's going up and down. I know there's other places, but Wisconsin's really known for that too. So. Uh, let me know. Please throw it in the comments below. Give me your little tips what helps you. I I stay away from like Bengay or anything with menthol in it because that makes my skin hurt more. It makes it like more sensitive. I hope that makes sense. But make sure you share this video so we can see what other people are saying. And maybe some of you are wondering the same thing. Maybe together we can find some more options because you know those options are slim. Oh, okay, the other thing I want you guys to know, I'm going to be a cheater, okay? And I'm going to try recording, filming a few videos at once and then that way I can, when I'm not feeling so well, I can edit it because you, know, you guys know what's all been going on. Um, I can edit it and get it uploaded for you and no worries. So, especially with kids starting, um, they're going to be off of school really soon. I think they got like 20 days left. Right now it's their first day of spring break. It is Wednesday, so I'm going to try like heck to get this up for you tomorrow. 
So I hope you don't mind that. So if you see me in the same shirt or whatever, you know what? But right now it's raining. So we're getting rid of the snow right now. It's just a slushy, nasty mess. If you made it this far through the video, you guys, you're awesome. Thank you. Um, comment below what the weather is by you, okay? I think it's 50 degrees today, maybe. I don't know. And make sure you comment below, subscribe, show some love. And welcome to all the new spoonies. Nice to see you here. Make sure you check out Who is Fiber Mom video and get to know me a little bit better. Because these poor guys have to hear me repeat this in every video. <laughs> Those are some true spoonies. Alright, thanks a bunch again, you guys. And I hope you're feeling well. If you're not, hang in there. And I will talk to you in the next video. Love you. If you want to see some crazy and also lazy, then you should meet me and my friends. Even though we got no money, we sure as hell funny. Yeah, everything's better with them. We're just like, ooh.